Oh, nothing. I just kind of banged myself yeah, trying to sit down. Oh, I thought I rode the wrong thing. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, that, you, yeah that's right. Okay, yeah, go ahead. And so then what we want to do is differentiate that denominator. Oh, do you want um, to differentiate the denominator only? Yeah, we could we could differentiate the whole thing, but to maximize that, really, we just need to get the de derivative of the denominator and set it equal to zero, and then see if it's positive or negative to find out if it's a maximum or minimum. Oh, okay, okay. I, I know what you mean. I was confused. That's a perpe uh, perpetual state I, for I me. Was, I was differentiating the whole thing. That's why I said, well, David, want to do this? <laughs> Okay, so differential of the denominator. Yes. It would be uh, minus R of square x divided by 4 R of L square. Is that what you got? Mm. Um, R of x differential is 0, right? And all of L equal one. Oh, derp! <laughs> Is that? Wait. Plus. <laughs> and let it equal to zero. Wait, wait, wait! Back the truck up. I'm getting confused. I got okay. con. Why? Why? Why is uh, R sub S zero? Differentiate. Wait, wait, wait. Oh yeah, you want to differentiate um, with respect to all all the L, right? Mhm. Mm so we consider this guy right, as a constant. Oh. So different difference A of a constant is zero. Right. D D X. D D X of C is equal to zero. Uh huh. Oh. So with respect to R sub L, this is considered constant. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. That's why I got this one. So, okay, I get it. Now you'll move the negative 1 over there, which will make it R squared over RL. Mm -hmm. Which will give you R squared S equals R squared L, which is equivalent to RS equals RL. Um, yeah, before. Oh man, you should be a calculus tutor. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you're you're so good. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. The best to be sure. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that, is, that, is that what you want me to do? Yes, absolutely. The part that confused me was the uh was the R sub S being considered a constant. Oh, derp! Yeah. Wait a second, wait a second. But if, obviously, if you're trying to, uh, if you're trying to match it to the load, then of course the source is going to be constant. Yes. Ah, intuitively that makes perfect sense. Oh, yeah, yeah, it makes sense for me too. <laughs>